across the host. There's two penalties early. I have no reason no reason to obstruct. Go three. Stop with a good tackle. Good rather than today the opponent's York City now. It's good ball. Very well to start in seven, seven minutes for host. Good offload as well. Is there something here? and it's certainly a hostile atmosphere here at Bovham Crescent this afternoon. The Bulls are doing it tough, and they've done it tough with Jay Hitchcock. Right, let's be having New York. Jump shot side, the pick numbers oh, here player. of the York City Knights, they threw a hole. Out onto the outside, it's Salter, drifts back in. Jump. Back to stop, stop now, applaud the ball to team there. York will be delighted with their first effort with the ball. Let's go fighting and scrapping on the floor. This is Lockwood in the tackle. Again, three City Knights. Salter is going to get us underway. And this is the first real examination of this Featherston line for the York City Knights. Red, Amber and Black. York in their traditional yellow and black, and they'll move it over on that far stand side. Two tackles gone. They're just outside their own 20 metre line. We've had 20 seconds gone on Bradford Bulls Live on Pulse 2 this afternoon, and it's Farrell and Wilde and Hallas throwing themselves around early in that defence. How did Dummy have? It's going to go from Will Jump. Jump now to Robinson. An unintended result to see why he is the top try scorer, looking very, very dangerous. One. And prepared to take the defensive line on, which is a, a, a big threat for a halfback. Well, for him to be a threat, he needs people on the inside and outside pushing up. So the defensive line is forcing and what is running about him. And then Matty Marsh obviously tucks the ball under his. Impeccably well. Michella will play the ball. Here goes Wilde. Wilde makes 10 metres forward. He's up to halfway. Fourth tackle gone. Hallis in there at dummy half. The call in for it on that fast hand side. Lily doesn't take the pass and it goes with Hallis and Hallis will just calm things down a little bit for the Bradford. He did too many points and certainly right for Ryan Carr to address that. With the ball they've been great at times and, 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 and looked dangerous. They've scored some big score lines. Their points four is huge. But... Kick three, tick three for Ashton Golding. There's a perception with, with Ashton Golding. Maybe this is why he hasn't started more games at fullback uh, at a higher level than he already has done and that was... Robinson, four from four that afternoon. Ethan Ryan with a couple of tries. And here come York and Marcus Stock. He's brought down 10 metres out. Jub out of the old job. Acting half. That was too easy for mine. Uh, it wasn't a warning shot about the, the, the acting half there. It was a warning shot for Bradford Bulls mentality there. A really good defensive set. It, it pinned York City Knights down in their own half. Coming off the fifth tackle. And there on tackle number four in front of the Bradford Post. Jub out of dummy half to Scott. Sam Scott's brought down in front of the Bradford Post now. We're tracking the David Longhurst down. Cooper, I think. It was all congested down there. There were so many attackers, so many defenders. It's so hard as a guy running a line to get through the line and not make contact. Realises time is against the balls. We've got 18 minutes remaining here at Melbourne Crescent and York now lead for 10 points, just like they did in that first. By 20 points to 12. It's all happening in the Super League. Bradford though on the restart here, all happening in the championship, Wilde to Oaks, Bradford's fourth try scorer this afternoon. Side from King, here's Walters, he's got the winning try in the 2015, 2015 grand, grand final. final. 
I remember that. And Barrow, they need to pick up wins to uh, avoid the drop along with Rochdale. On that restart then, second tackle gone, York. 25 metres out from that Bradford line. Mikey Wood leaves the field. Alice back on there. Minchella George. Crossley. Crossley sucks that ball in and also sucks three York City Knights defenders out of that defensive line. And he's 11 metres out from the York line. It's now another season for the Bradford Bull. A massive setting attack. Bradford no of win here. We'll take him two points behind York. Away to George. Joe Brown. Joe Brown is wrapped up there by Jubb and bringing in stock in a three man York City Knights tackle. It's 24 points apiece here on Pulse 2 between the Knights and the Bulls. It's another thriller between the Betfred League 1. Bulls didn't really capitalise that, they weren't expecting it. Um, as here come York now on the 50 metre line, really pushing out. That wasn't an altercation on the sideline either, Mick. That was. Coming up. <laughs> Much better. Come on, move, come on.